Averting water ghosts by reciting Amitabha. Near a surface of a river, were many log cabins. One night, a worker was making bamboo wares by a window, when he suddenly heard strange voices. He listened advertently. There were two water goats. Tomorrow afternoon, said one excitedly to the other, "I'll have a substitute. I can finally leave." The next afternoon, a drunkard Julie reached the river bank, carrying a shoulder pole. He laid the pole on the ground and squished groggily, cupping his hands. He drank from the river. A force seemed to be pulling him down. He nearly fell into the water. The worker in the cabin above saw what happened. He was stunned. But what's going on? He did not die. He just walked away. The worker was curious. In the evening, he sat by the window again, listening carefully. A spirit said in despair, "I almost dragged him into the water," but he grumbled, "Amitabha, the water is so tasty, and I was bound several meters away." He then drank more. And spoke the Buddha's name several times. I was scared out of my wits and couldn't move at all. Reciting Amitabha's name is the best way to avoid calamity. Busy or not, we should always recite. Thank you, Namo Amitabha Buddha.